Are you tired of having to minimize your game to check your peripheral's battery life? Don't want to download yet another software to monitor your hardware's utilization? Is it just too much work to minimize your game to answer a Discord call? If you answered yes to any of these questions, then Rocket has a solution for you. Introducing Smart Keys. Rocket Smart Keys gives keys on your Rocket keyboard two LEDs, one for the typical backlight and a second LED right under the backlight LED that changes colors to show you what's active, as well as to tell you useful information without wasting those precious seconds of yours since you can't be bothered to alt tab. To activate a smart key, hold the function button and press any of the smart key buttons. On the Rocket Vulcan 2 Max, you have a total of 24 smart keys, with F1 through F4 being the four different profiles you can select from, which save things like your lighting effects, your button remaps, and macros. F5 brings up the Rocket Swarm software. F6 mutes and unmutes the microphone on your Rocket headset so you don't have to raise your hand and flip it up or down. F7 will answer and end your Discord calls without you having to minimize. And it also blinks to let you know that you're getting a call in case you're in streamer mode, which silences Discord notification sounds. F8 lets you know when you have an unread Discord message, which again is useful if you're in streaming mode. F9 lets you record macros. F10 starts and stops your Twitch streams as long as you're using OBS or Twitch Studio. And it breathes purple while you're live, which is pretty cool. F11 and F12 are battery indicators for your Rocket mouse and headset, turning green, yellow, or red depending on the battery life. Print screen, scroll lock, and break shows your CPU, GPU, and RAM utilization by also turning green, yellow, or red depending on usage. Insert, home, page up or down, end, and delete all double as macro buttons. You can hold function and press the Windows key to toggle game mode, which disables the Windows key so you don't accidentally minimize your game in a clutch situation. And while we're on game mode, if you hold caps lock, it enables easy shift, which is a second layer of keys, basically doubling the amount of keys your keyboard has with infinite customization. Want the W key to be Alt F4? Go ahead. Want the spacebar to open an application? By all means. Want to set the F key to restart your PC, then you accidentally press it and have your PC restart and run all those updates you've been holding off on because you don't want to wait for the updates to complete that you never asked for in the first place? No issues at all. The possibilities are endless. So endless, and useful in fact, that despite me disliking 65% keyboards because of their lack of function keys, which I personally use all the time, the Vulcan 2 Mini is the only 65% keyboard I can use because it makes it nearly as easy to use as a full-size keyboard, despite it having literally only 65% of the buttons of a full-size keyboard. Just assign the F keys, or whatever buttons you want, to any of the buttons for when you're in easy shift mode, turn game mode on, and voila! It's like they never left. It's so much easier than having to use two hands or moving my left hand all the way to the function button and the F key I want to use. This is a game changer for small keyboards in my opinion, and allows me to keep the functionality of a larger keyboard without having a large keyboard on my desk taking up precious mouse space. Now, as for the layout for the Vulcan 2 Mini's smart keys, they're similar to what the Vulcan 2 Max has, just in different places. And again, it's all customizable within the Rocket Swarm software. All you have to do is go to the key assignments tab, click on whatever key you want to change, click the remap button to assign a new key, or go to the functions window on the left and drag and drop any of the endless functions you want to replace the default functions. And if you also don't like the default colors that the smart keys light up, you can easily change them by clicking on the smart key manager button on the bottom, selecting what function you want to change and selecting a new color as well as what lighting effects you want, as long as that function supports lighting effects. So what are you waiting for? Go to rockat.com to get your smart key enabled keyboard and make your friends jealous because their keyboard can't do what yours can. Unless they have the Vulcan 2 Mini or Max, in which case it can. Anyway, I'm Bijan Jamshidi. I hope you enjoyed my video on Rockat smart keys and have a great day every day. Peace.